shot and left for dead. No one discovered Dana Mayo's body for days, and tonight his family pleads for answers. A candlelight vigil was held tonight for the 37-year-old at the site of his murder. Our Todd Walker was there. Todd, no arrests have been made, and we understand police still searching for leads in this case, right? Yeah, Rory, right now there are several kids who will be spending Christmas without their dad, and they don't know why. Tonight they gathered to try and ease their pain. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Tonight, dozens of family and friends came together to sing, remember, and pray for justice for Dana Mayo. He was shot and killed in his, in his car outside of a vacant home on Flicker Drive in the Whites Creek area Wednesday. Police say the car had been sitting in the driveway since Monday. His mother said he left the home, their, their home around 4 in the afternoon on Monday and never returned. Neighbors say they heard gunshots Monday night. His family is pleading for anyone who knows anything to call police. They want justice for how long they say Mayo was le just left there. Please come forward and help me get closure because I won't get closure until I know something is done. So I just please just just please help me. If you have any information, you are urged to call Metro Crime Stoppers at 74 Crime. You can remain anonymous and possibly qualify for a cash reward. Just a sad story for that family. All the way around. All right, Todd, thanks.